strengthened its mantra to Sabka Saath, Sabka Vikas, and Sabka Vishwas. Our development philosophy covered all elements of inclusivity, namely social inclusivity through coverage of all strata of the society, and geographical in inclusivity through development of all regions of the country. With the whole of nation approach of Sabka Prayas, the country overcame the challenges of once in a century pandemic, took long strides towards Atmanirbhar Bharat, committed to Panch Pran, and laid solid foundations for the Amritkal. As a result, as a result, our young country has high aspirations, pride in its present, and hope and confidence for a bright future. We expect that our government, based on its stupendous work, will be blessed again by the people with a resounding mandate. Inclusive development and growth. Our humane and inclusive approach to development is a marked and deliberate departure from the earlier approach of provisioning up to village level. Development programs were thus provisioned. In the last 10 years, however, have targeted each and every household and individual through housing for all, har ghar jal, electricity for all, cooking gas for all, bank accounts and financial services for all in record time. The worries about food, the worries about food have been eliminated through free ration for 80 crore people. Minimum support, minimum support prices for the produce of Annadatta are periodically increased appropriately. These and the, base, and the provision of basic necessities have enhanced real income in the rural areas. Their economic needs could be addressed, thus spurring growth and generating jobs. Social justice. Our government is working with an approach to development that is all round, all pervasive, and all inclusive. Sarvangin, Sarvasparsi, or Sarvasamaveshi. It covers all castes and people at all levels. We are working to make India a Vikasit Bharat by 2047. For achieving that goal, we need to improve people's capability and empower them. Previously, social justice was mostly a political slogan. For our government, social justice is an effective and necessary governance model. The saturation, the saturation approach of covering all eligible people is the true and comprehensive achievement of social justice. This is secularism in action, reduces corruption, and prevents nepotism, prevents by Bhatijawad. There is transparency and assurance that benefits are delivered to all eligible people. The resources are distributed fairly. All, regardless of their social standing, get access to opportunities. We are addressing systemic inequalities that had plagued our society. We focus on outcomes and not on outlays, so that the social economic transformation is achieved. As our Prime Minister firmly believes, we need to focus on four major castes. They are Garib, Mahilaye, Yuva, and Annadatta. Their needs, their aspirations, and their welfare are our highest priority. The country progresses when they progress. All four require and receive government support in their quest to better their lives. Their empowerment and well-being will drive the country forward. 
गरीब कल्याण देश का कल्याण वी बिलीव इन एम्पावरिंग द पुअर द अर्लियर अप्रोच ऑफ टैकलिंग पॉवर्टी थ्रू एंटाइटलमेंट्स हैड रिजल्टेड इन वेरी मॉडेस्ट आउटकम्स वेन द पुअर बिकेम एम्पावर्ड पार्टनर्स इन द डेवलपमेंट प्रोसेस गवर्नमेंट्स पावर टू असिस्ट दम ऑल्सो इंक्रीजेस मैनीफोल्ड विद द परस्यूट ऑफ सबका साथ इन दीज टेन ईयर्स द गवर्नमेंट हैज असिस्टेड ट्वेंटी फाइव करोर पीपल to get freedom from multi dimensional poverty our government's efforts are now getting synergized with energy and passion of such empowered people this is truly elevating them from poverty direct benefit transfer of 34 lakh crore rupees from the government using pm jandan accounts has led to savings of 2.7 lakh crores of rupees for the government this savings has been realized through avoidance of leakages prevalent earlier the savings have helped in providing more funds for garib kalyan pm swanidhi has provided credit assistance to 78 lakh street vendors from that total from that total of 78 lakh street vendors 2.3 lakh have received credit for the third time pm janman yojana reaches out to the particularly vulnerable tribal groups who have remained outside the realm of development so far pm vishwakarma yojana provides end to end support to artisans and crafts people engaged in 18 trades the schemes for empowerment of divyangs and transgender persons reflect firm resolve of our government to leave no one behind welfare of annadata farmers are our annadata Every year under PM Kisan Samman Yojana direct financial assistance is provided to 11.8 crore farmers including marginal and small farmers crop insurance is given to 4 crore farmers under PM Fasal Bima Yojana these besides several other programs are assisting annadata in producing food for the country and for the world electronic national agricultural market has integrated 1361 mandis and is providing services to 1.8 crore farmers with trading volume of 3 lakh crores of rupees the sector is poised for inclusive balanced higher growth and productivity these are facilitated from farmer centric policies income support coverage of risks through price and insurance support promotion of technologies and innovations through startups empowering the amrit pd the yuva our prosperity depends on adequately equipping and empowering the youth the national education policy 2020 is assuring the transformational reforms pm schools for rising india pm shri are delivering quality teaching and nurturing holistic and well rounded individuals the skill india mission has trained 1.4 crore youth upskilled and reskilled 54 lakh youth and established 3000 new iti's a large number of institutions of higher learning namely seven iits 16 triple iits seven iims 15 aims and 390 universities have been set up pm mudra yojana has sanctioned 43 crore loans aggregating to 22.5 lakh crores of rupees for entrepreneurial aspirations of our youth 
Besides that, fund of funds, Startup India, and Startup Credit Guarantee schemes are assisting our youth. They are also becoming Rozgar Data. The country is proud of our youth scaling new heights in sports. The highest ever medal tally in Asian Games and Asian Para Games in 2023 reflects a high confidence level. Chess prod prodigy and our number one ranked player Pragnananda put up a stiff fight against the reigning world champion Magnus Carlsen in 2023. Today, India has over 80 chess grandmasters compared to little over 20 in 2010. Momentum for Nari Shakti. 